guest is a local artist who never dreamed she'd be creating art for a living. In fact, it wasn't until she was graduating from college that her life took a different path. Well, now she's creating one-of-a-kind pieces and getting national attention doing it. Welcome Evelyn Henson to Charlotte Today. <laughs> Hello, young lady. How are you doing? Good. Good. Thank oh, you. it's our pleasure. I love your work, first of all. Thank, Thank you, you so much for sharing it with all of us. Um, your story is really interesting. You started painting um, after your college roommate just left some paint. Yes, so okay. two of my friends were moving out for the summer and they had this box of craft paints that they didn't want, so they just gave it to me because they knew I really liked art, but I hadn't painted anything on my own really at that time. Um, so I just, it was Mother's Day, so I painted my mom some flowers, um, and I haven't put down the paintbrush since. It's so great. You were saying before we went on the air this morning that you just didn't realize that this was a career path. For you. No, no okay. idea. Had no idea, because you grow up with this myth of like the starving artist, um, which just isn't true today. Hmm. So. All right, now you started with this map series. Can you tell us about the map series you yes. started with? Yes, so I had seen all these maps floating around on Pinterest, and I thought it would be fun um, to make one of Furman University, which is where I was in school at the time. So I started with that one, and now it's grown into um, a series of 122 different places. Um, so the first one yeah. is right in front of you, Eugene, and that's of our lovely city, Charlotte. See, isn't this so cute? I love oh, that. Oh, really nice. And you do them of all kinds of cities, right? Right, yep. yeah. Isn't that great? All right, mm -hmm. now talk about your mugs here. Right, so you can also get the city design on a mug as well. So mm -hmm. I have Greenville, South Carolina, um, and then I have an assortment of fun animal mugs that feature different illustration and funny sayings just to make the morning a little bit more cheerful. I like coffee before talkie with the parents. <laughs> it's very cute. I totally relate to that. Coffee before talkie, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, those are so cute. What inspires you? Um, this is really cliche, but honestly, it's just everyday things. Mm -hmm. And I think most artists would say that, but it's true. The more that I paint, the more inspired I am by my surroundings. Oh. Um, yeah. Do you have a favorite thing to create? A favorite yes. thing? Yes. That's like, is hard. Um, is it like picking your favorite depends, child? You yeah, it depends on yeah. the season. I think my favorite thing to do is create gifts for people. Mm -hmm. And I think when I'm painting something for someone else, that's always really fun for me. And that's usually where I get my best ideas, too. So, like the dog mug down here, that's um, a gift item where you can choose from a set of a hundred different dogs and cats um, and that started as a joke for a gift for my sisters I thought it would be funny to like put our dogs on a mug for them and then I realized that other people are probably just as nuts as we are mm -hmm. so then yes. it turned into this whole gift oh isn't that so cute that's it so great indeed. now you've been very successful your work has been featured in a lot of places glamour magazine yeah. town and country mm -hmm. people.com and actress Reese Witherspoon mm -hmm. she featured um, your art on her Instagram account right she did such a great day when that happened because I grew up with a life-size um, legally blonde poster in my room so for that to be the celebrity that shared my work on Instagram that was a cool moment for it was sure. meant to be what does it feel like though to get that kind of recognition for your work it's definitely cool because like I mm -hmm. said I didn't even know that I could be an artist at all so every day to like be like this is such a cool thing that I get to paint um, and then to get recognized for it is grateful yeah. for that and as you're, well. not, you're not slowing down at all you have, do you have a lot of no. ideas that just keep coming to you yeah, it's like I said, the more I paint, the more inspired I am. Um, it's like uh, Picasso said, inspiration exists, but it has to find you working. Mm -hmm. um, and I find that so true with my art. I love it. Where can people find your work? So they can go to my website, EvelynHenson.com, E-V-E-L-Y-N-H-E-N-S-O-N. -E -E um, and they can follow me on Instagram, Evelyn underscore Henson, to Good. see what I'm up to. You've got all kinds of, you've got little journals and notebooks and greeting yeah. cards, too. It's yeah, so, so cute. Yeah, so these are a lot of cute gift ideas oh, love um, it. I love it like that and you know you can go I, I was looking at your website before the show and I thought oh I want to order all these city pictures for everybody and they're very affordable too I, I should mention that go to evelynhenson.com evelynhenson.com for more information Evelyn a pleasure and congratulations to thank you thank you great thank